Book of Revelation, Episode 1 of 6, Main Players and Themes. The structure of the Book of Revelation follows that of a Greek tragedy consisting of six episodes across a time period of three and a half years. Episode 1 introduces the main players, themes, and events of the entire book or play. Jesus Christ addresses seven actual churches located in Asia Minor, revealing 21 facts about himself. Jesus shines with heavenly glory. He is the first and the last. He died, but now lives forevermore. He dwells amongst the churches. He knows our works, our troubles, where we dwell. He grants us rewards. He searches our mind and our heart. He gives to each of us according to our works. He has received the Father's authority. He will come as a thief when we know not. He is holy and true. He holds the keys. He opens and he shuts. He honors his word and his name. He loves us. He will make us a pillar in the temple of God. He will write his name upon us. He counsels us. He loves, reproves, and disciplines us. He stands knocking and will enter and sup with us. He has conquered and sits upon the Father's throne. It is he who will soon come and make war against his enemies. Jesus approves of fourteen virtues in his followers. They hear him and they conquer. They patiently endure. They repent of their sins and return to their work. They hear what the Spirit says to the churches. They test apostles. They endure tribulation, poverty, and slander. They endure prison. They remain faithful unto death. They show love, faith, and good works. They hold fast what they have until Jesus come. They keep Jesus' words. They do not deny Jesus' name. They hear, remember, keep, and repent. They hear his voice and open the door to him. Jesus warns his followers against eight spiritual dangers. He finds our faults. He warns us about Satan, the devil, about false teaching and false prophets. He warns against immorality and idolatry. He warns those who are dead, though having a false reputation. We are not to deny his name. He warns us against the synagogue of Satan and against growing lukewarm, blind, even naked. Jesus offers 14 eternal rewards to those who remain faithful to him. They will eat of the tree of life in the paradise of God, receive a crown of life, suffer no second death, receive a white stone with a new name. They will see him come. They will see him come soon. They will exercise authority over nations, ruling with a rod of iron. They will walk with Jesus in white robes. Their name will appear in the book of life. Jesus will confess them to God and the angels keeping them from the hour of trial which is coming upon the world. They will be made a pillar in the temple of God. They will bear the name of God, of his city, and of Jesus. They will dwell in the new Jerusalem. Lastly, Jesus warned of five punishments reserved for the faithless. Their lampstand will be removed. They will suffer the second death. He will throw them into tribulation. They will go through the hour of trial that is coming upon the whole earth. They will suffer eternal shame of nakedness. Episodes 2 through 6 will describe these themes and events in greater detail and in sequential order.